Hi. That oh, wrong game. Sorry. Uh, I do have Dwarf Fortress open. I just I had the wrong, had the wrong thing on that thing. Oh God! Come on! Oh no! Come on! Oh fuck! Okay, got it. <coughs> hey, welcome back to Boogeyman. Are you ready to bo boogie down? Yeah, I didn't think so. <clears throat> anyway, hi, welcome back to, welcome back. Uh, today we're going to be fighting boogeymen. We're going to boogie down. Um, I don't actually know where they are. Let me stop sprinting. Let me switch to just a fast air jaunt. Um, I found out an easy way to kill boogeymen. Um at least uh, here is, well, first of all, I want my spear. I don't want to fight with no stupid, stupid staff. All right, an easy way to fight boogeymen when you can fly is um, sneaking up behind them because um, despite them clearly being able to see you, the, um, the mechanics of Dwarf Fortress prevents people from, like, uh, tracking you. Well, well, you're flying. Yeah, so you can just sneak up right behind them in plain sight, all right? So do a little stabby dodgy thing. Dodge southwest, bam. Okay, that's a dead one. Get back into the air. Okay, that is a dead one, right? Um, tendon, artery, ooh, actually, you might not be finished. I just, you know, make sure to get back into the air before anybody else notices, okay? Another... Good old head stab. I wish I had a better spear, but okay, how about that? Gonna turn around to attack? No? Alright, we might be okay to just assassinate this guy. Yeah, artery has been opened. Yeah, just open a bunch of arteries. Yeah, it's fine. I don't know what's going on here, but I am certainly not in the air, so I don't know why they aren't attempting to find me. It's fine. You bleeding real good? Yeah, he's bleeding real good. Let me just get another artery, and then, then we'll, we'll be good. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, that's one down. Go ahead and sneak up on this guy. Okay, nobody saw me. Assassin style. Let me try to get him a good old... Good old heart stab. No, nah, next stab, since I got an opportunity for that. Just try to paralyze him real quick. I think something about this whole dot... Oh, my God, that guy's dead immediately. All right, well, I was about to say, I think something about this whole dodging thing might be janking things out and stopping stuff from turning around to realize I'm attacking them. Jeez! All right, so never mind my diss against this bronze spear. Yeah, this one sees me. Never mind me dissing this bronze spear, because apparently it's strong enough to just decapitate boogeymen. Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> just this time with one that notices me. No! Nope. Well, I missed, so I don't know if that would have worked or not. Okay. Just keep dodging. Ooh! Yeah, I might want to, like, um... I might want to fly away from this one. Stab and dodge. Come on. Oh, shit! Oh, no, it's okay. It's just a heart bruise. All right, that's fine. That's not actually a lethal wound. It just scares you. All right, jump. Can I jump away from this? Oh, God. Okay. Fly up. Fly, uh, we're fine. Fly up. Okay, we're fine. See? Let me just confirm I did just get a bruise to the heart. Yeah? Uh, tearing apart the skin, bruising the fat, okay, uh, bruising the muscle, and bruising the heart. That's fine. Just got a heart bruise. Not lethal, just scary. We're fine. Okay, let's sneak up behind this dude. Try to get another wild neck assassination. Dodge to the southeast. Come on. Ha, <laughs> there we go. Fortunately, boogeymen are still afoot. Let me just try to find another one. 
and here you see Rauru fight on despite uh, despite suffering from a painful broken heart. The fuck is the next boogeyman? One has vanished, so that means another one's gonna appear nearby. But where? Uh, by the way, I'm trying trying to eschew music for this episode just to see. You know, distance makes the oh my god, there's two of them. Distance makes the heart grow stronger, or whatever. I'm sure that's not the correct quote, but here we go. Let's try another next assassination. Dodge to the southeast. Flying neck assassination. Yeah. Okay, just think I'm on this guy. I shouldn't be sprinting this whole time, but okay. How about now? Get another one. Ha! <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> uh, this reminds me of the day that I grew to rule the night. As, as my ancient ancestors once did, I flew into the night and uh, swooped down upon the weaker, smaller night creatures until I had thinned out the herd enough that they were no longer able to persist in their corruption of our mortal realm. Yes, indeed, I am solely responsible for causing the uh, the collapse of the boogeyman gate. Yes. I was intending to make a whole story gag out of that, but I, I, I decided to scare you. Let me sleep until dawn. Yeah, since I'm... Hello, it's dawn. Okay, so where was I going to go from here? Um, map, center on me, I was going to go, oh god, was I going to fly over the mountains? Jesus, oh boy, I would much rather go around the mountain, but that's a serious detour, and I'd have to deal with boogeymen several times, um, uh, But which would take longer in real time? That's the question, because if I go this way, I can probably make it across the mountains in, like, one day, since I can fly. But if I go this way, it's going to take several, and I'll have to sleep and eat and hunt at least twice and deal with boogeymen occasionally. Oh, boy. I got a coin. Let me flip a coin. Uh, heads for mountains. Okay, it's tails, so I'm going to go the long way around. <sighs> Hold on a sec. Um, okay, I'm just checking something and closing a couple of stuff. Alright, so I might as well like pack up a bunch of food, right? Um, I wish I could find, like, a, I, I hope I find, like, a lair or a cool shrine on my way down. Let me stop here, because if I wait any longer, then by the time I found, find prey, I won't be able to satisfy my hunger without getting sick. Oh, dude, look, empty trees. I haven't seen those in adventure mode. Goes to show how often I get, get got. Oh, dude, don't frickin' maximum speed fly through the forest. That sounds like a recipe for a broken neck. Uh, hello, you... That's a kestrel, I can't eat that. It would violate my moral sensibilities to eat another bird. I mean, picture you consuming a baboon. Ours, well, you just see me as a bird, where well, I see you as nothing more than a baboon. Ah, oh, but you say there's a great difference between you and a baboon. Well, I think not. You both have noses, don't you? You both have ears. Oh, ooh, boars or bears? Boars, right? Hey, boars, let me just spook the ones that can see me off. Oh, wow, well, you're not going to make this easy for me, are you? Okay, 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 wait a, wait a minute. Ah, 
and the least wary boar remains prepare to be consumed nick stab got it he's he's dead just keep mauling him he's fine just keep mauling him just keep mauling him her sorry beautiful you fought well oh my goodness I can get multiple bones from him. Uh, boar bones, I don't think, do much, though. Oh, boar bones are good. Uh, what What is, um... The plus one, I don't think, is as good as bronze, right? Plus two... I don't know. What a boar spear? Hey, boar spear. W would that be better than my bronze one? I mean, if I can get a high-quality one, probably... Let me get a couple branches here. Make a couple staves. Got hiccups. Come on, give me some branches. I want some branches. There we go. We got some branches. Just uh, two, maybe three. It's like three branches. I gotta remember to uh, get some more javelins. Yeah. So I kind of wanted to, um, uh, I kind of wanted to stop. I'm not meaning to move around. I kind of wanted to, uh, use throwing weapons and stuff, but I don't know. That feels too broken since, you know, I can just toss things from safety. I feel like if Dwarf Fortress was a little better with handling flying creatures, um, I would feel a little better, like, if, if they would, you know, run for cover or try to throw things or heck if they can fly if they would at least follow me into the air but right now the pathing of npcs it would be an astronomical feat for them all to have to calculate finding something midair <laughs> what was that thing though right okay staves right make the stave is Make a the stave. Oh, I should have made a macro for it. Two stave and one more two stave. Okay. Got at the bones. Got the teeth and here no teeth here. Okay, got it. All right. <clears throat> Control record. Move over here. Bone weapons. Uh, Spear or pike? I don't know. I guess spear. Out of the oh, I shouldn't have been recording it because I just realized since we're using different bones. Okay, so got like a well-crafted one. Let me see. Do we got any more? I thought that we had multiple bones. Nope. I guess we just got hooves. Well, I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. Bourbon. I can see. I'll, I'll next hunting trip. I'll test it out. But right now, I just want to get going. 136. No. Okay. Drink some wawa. Drink some wawa. Oh, I just dropped it. No, ugh. You know what I should study up on? I should study up on what you can brew um, in Adventure Craft here. Because there's, like, potions and stuff, which are neat. Um, let me look up. Um, Adventure Craft. Look at me. I'm sure I didn't have to include the... Alchemy part. Beethoven forums releases. Yeah, this should be it. Hey, KS Volt, I'm looking at your avatar right now. Uh, let's see. Features. Uh, spoil. Are we gonna spoil anything? Oh shoot! Right, it's um. It's got like its own special, like spoiler page, right? This is a. 
plant tweaks, new creatures, new items, new uses. Ah, uh, boy. I can't remember where to find it. Oh, man. Ah, appendices. Eh? Yeah? Um... Here we go. Uh, okay, we got Dwarven Syrup, Gnome Blight, which is useless. We got Golden Salve, which is like a, a little healy thing. Boosts your recuperation and cures bleeding. Uh, Marshmend from Muckroot. Again, just healing and pain relief. Whip, whi Whiplash is um, agility and speed boost. Cool. But it also makes you nauseous, which wouldn't that just... Wouldn't that just counteract the speed boost? Whatever, if I ever find whip vine, we can see. And then there's barbed haze, which sounds really, really neat. Um, it just does fun. And then there's all the, um, all the mega beast stuff. Okay. No bilberry potions, no sorcery references. Too bad. Oh, but you know what's going to really cut down traveling costs? Traveling costs. Traveling time. You can just walk over rivers <laughs> in this version. Sweet. Oh, man, that is, a, that is a feature that's been needed for a long time. Let me just sleep in a tree like a real owl. Yeah, dude, that looks comfy as heck. Woo! 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 I have a flute that I can make owl sounds on. Hello? You good? Am I being ambushed or is it just daytime? You good? Get a little sip of the jinky? Yep, we're good. Cool. Hope I run into something on accident. Uh, how close are we? We're about like halfway around the little bend of the mountain, which is about like. I don't know, a third of the adventure. I'd walk a thousand miles, a thousand miles to see you. As something, every gasp of breath, I find it just, no, I grab it just to find you. Oh, man. That's the theme song for Mushishi, Mush, Mushishi, by the way, if you don't know what that is. it's Man, that is a beautiful anime. I feel like it's not nearly popular enough. I guess because it's not like a really cutesy or uh, power fantasy-ish anime. It's, it's, it's just about a, it's just about like a Japanese medicine man going around Japanese folklore land fixing up people who were possessed by well cursed by bad japanese shaman shaman spirits he's got like a backpack made of wood with like lots of trinkets in it it's a it's really fun and its theme song is so nostalgic for me because it was like one of the first ones that i ever like binged and took seriously. Before that, it was all like, uh, uh, I don't know, High School of the Deads and uh, uh, Seki Race. <laughs> I was 16, okay? But then after that, I, I discovered, oh, there's like a, there's like a real, ooh, look at this little forest here. Neat. Is this like a special thing? The fiery junk roots. Ooh, wow, there's lots of stuff here. Anyway, Mushishi is, like, one of the ones that gave me, like, a serious appreciation of uh, anime. And, like, it can have actual serious shows that don't revolve around boob girls. Ooh, you can get bamboo branches now. Ooh, boy. Is it, like, better? Or... No. I mean... He might have given it, like, uh, better um, pokey values, but I don't know. 
what kind of plants we got here. I'm looking for some good plants. We got bananas. We got we got amaranths. We got bamboo. If I was better at modding, I, I would like add more uses for plants and stuff. Like add rudimentary alchemy. What time is it? Oh, okay. I was just drowsy, so I wasn't sure. Um, map. As I wandered across those rolling hills, untamed by man, I saw many great creatures and many small as well, but none were greater than I, for I knew should any challenge my dominion over the realm after I freed them from the night creatures, I would surely, I would surely beat them up with my staff. Hello, we under attack? Is it boogeyman? Oh, hello, wow, alright. Shit, no fuck off, oh, god damn it. Fucking go. Oh, God. What is going on here? What's going on? Can I fly? Or did they get my wound? Uh, freaking wings. And every gasp of breath I should just to find you. Alright, so my heart, I should have been paying attention. Heart, spine, is my spine okay? The health, ability to stand loss, somewhat impaired. Um, wounds, um, let's see, neck, neck feathers, that's fine. Toe, broken. Arm, bruised. Left, uh, wrist, bad. Okay, arm is ouched. Eye is bruised. Leg is bruised. Foot. Okay. My ouchy leg. Okay, got real bad bruising. Got fractures. Okay. Arm. Elbow bad. Elbow bad. Um, my foot. Ouch. Ooh, owie. Okay. Freaking idiot should have been paying attention. All right. Arm, boo boos. Arm, left foot, boo boos. Boo 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 boo. Um. Anything else? Okay. Do I got a like a nerve? Any nerves boo booed? My guts are bruised, which is pretty much my biggest, my biggest concern right now. This is what I get for not carrying around my stupid dangle. Stupid dang. Uh, crutches. What, what's my mortal wound, by the way? What's my mortal wound? I'm not seeing any. It's just heart. Health. Drowsy, thirsty, hungry. Can't stand, and I'm in pain. Um... Seem to be fine. I don't see what the mortal wound is. Just my elbows and stuff are hurt. I'm not even bleeding or anything. Overlapping fracture in my... Ooh. Ouch. I might save it here. Because I'm not really ready to deal with this situation that I've... Frickin'... Uh... See, I just zone out and stop paying attention at the worst possible moments. Oh, boy. Yeah, I'm not seeing any, like, uh, damage to my heart or anything. Do I have arms, period? Ah, oh boy, how long has the episode been? Because if it's been an acceptable m amount of time... Oh, God, it's only been 20 minutes. Oh... All right, I'll try to deal with it. I'm going to go for my old reliable spear. Um, 
the shield. Okay, I have at least one hand. Yeah, I have one hand. Anyone coming up? Yep, there's that boy. Try to get a, try to get a neck strike. Oh fuck, I can't. Oh god. Oh fuck, here we go. I'm gonna fall through the trees. I'm not. I can still fly. Hello. Hello. If I can get out of reach. Ooh, boy. Ah, I'm getting winded. I don't recall having anything bad happen to my chest. Um, neck, toe, arm. Ah, uh, head. Head, fine, that's fine. My head is torn apart. That's fine. Uh, fuck. Let's see, knee, toes, skin. Ankle. Uh, shoulder, foot, leg. Uh, where the heck is hand? Body. Ah, upper body. Heart. Bruised. That's fine. So my heart is bruised. That's probably the lethal wound, but why am I having trouble breathing? What's up with that? Is that a new thing, or... My hip is boo-booed. My bones boo-booed. My wrist, ouch. Come on, get up here, so, so that I can dodge, dude. Come on. Alright, so I'm not, like, suffocating. I was just momentarily winded, probably got a, a big old boo-boo. Where are they? Are they climbing down, or are they getting into the next tree? You guys coming? How would I start waiting full turns? Come on, guys. See, I don't want to move, because then I'd be... So wait, are my wings okay? Because I'm flying right now. Oh, 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 I can fly still. Hello, I'm safe. All right. We are not in the danger zone after all. We're fine. <laughs> okay. Let me just make a macro. Uh, make sure I'm pressing the right buttons. Just wait. You know, actually, let me make sure I... I let me just get this precise. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25... 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. Okay, so that's what, um... Oh, why did I go for 40? I meant to go for 50. It's, uh, this is what I'm talking about. I lose focus. Thankfully, my dumb hubris didn't get me fucked over today. Um, it's because I was talking trash about the boogeyman. All right, so... Each one is 10 seconds, and I did it 40 times. It's 400, 400 seconds each. 400 divided by 60 is like 6 minutes. Oh boy, I got 6 minutes at a time. Let me go for 100. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 34, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 68, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Okay. 
But do that over and over. Just keep doing it. Just keep doing it. Weather? Stars are out. Can't even see the moon. I don't know if that means like the moon is setting or it's like still freaking rising. And if I sneak around, I might be able to handle these guys. Uh, breeze is blowing from the west. Mm. I don't know though. I keep getting winded and nauseous and I just don't. Mm. I'm safe in the air. As long as I don't land, I'll be okay. Other. Uh, still no sun. Here, let me just go ham. Yeah? Screw measuring things. Just go fucking ham! Just... I could sneak down and, like, uh. get some, uh, branches from some trees. Yeah, there we go. Let's see how long that macro takes. Hmm. I'm not seeing any, like, inhuman speed. Alright, I guess that was shorter than what I did. The cool breeze blowing from the wedge. I can't tell. I can't tell how close the sun is. Do I have... Are both of my... Are both of my legs... Broked. Okay, oh boy. Uh, we'll just uh, right leg, left. Yeah, both of my both of my legs are fucked, so I wouldn't be able to get. Oh, I'm I'm yielding now. Okay. No, stay down there. Help! My God, help! Oh, I'm an old man. You wouldn't want... <clears throat> Sorry. Oh, okay. No, I wasn't yielding. I was just looking at myself. Yeah, so I wasn't waiting that whole time. You know, why don't I just, uh... You know what might be even faster to do? I'll just get as high as I can. Uh, it just seems to be right here. Just... Where do I need to go right now? Uh, northwest? Yeah, just northwest. Let me just fly north. Oh, right. Uh, let me just fly north at the slowest possible speed. Because I figure, you know, I'm so slow, this might actually take longer <laughs> than just waiting several hundred turns at a time. I have I have my tin whistle with me. I could I I could actually make an attempt to do that. You know the mission impossible stuff. What time is it? What time is it now? How close am I? Actually, if I go northeast, uh, there's some... There's some hillocks over here. I don't know. By the time I get inside, I... Considering I'm freaking broken... Oh, hello. Here comes the sun! do do do, -do. Here comes the sun, and I say, 
Hooray! Cackling fades away. Let me go with a normal crawl. Okay, now to see the damage. Okay, move. And... We're fine. We're completely fine. My folly! I folly you! I make no mistakes. I learn from no mistakes. <laughs> now let's go sleep in a tree again. Hey, want to see some sorcery right here? Something that I, I've never thought about doing. Despite, you know, having done this with other stuff. Okay, I just dumped my water, my, my water quiver out. Just fill it back up. Behold! Conjured water. Are you shocked? Be you amazed? Okay, where's, um... Fair be the map. Right, let me go north to those hillocks. Leave these hillocks alone. These hillocks are too sullen for me. I'm a sleepy boy. I guess I'll spread my rumor of that one... That one troll I killed. Night troll, sorry. To the drinking mound! Hooray! Where is it? Where is the drinking mound? Is this it? This looks pretty big. That's yeah, probably the drinking mound. I like how colorful they are. Hello. Wow. Oh, wow. It sure is dark in here. You, you sure have a yak laying on the floor. Why can I see right here? Why can I only see right here? Right? Truly. Hello, beekeeper. My name is Rauru Tricked Trammel. Okay. I don't think that was my name before. Greetings. My name is Rauru Tricked Trammel. I am an adventurer from the east. I have come seeking an ancient tower and eldritch library. <clears throat> Hello, great. <clears throat> Hello, great horned owlman. <clears throat> I'm Kogan. Splatter tomb. <laughs> um, bring up. Uh, oh wow. Um. Oh hey, I actually haven't collected very many rumors for some reason. Uh, so it should be conflict, conflict, like conflict. Rumor, rumor. I'm looking for the. Looking for the valid ones, not all these grayed out ones. I thought that it would be faster if I went from the back, but no, there's like... Alright, you can uh, page like this. Mega scroll! Wow. This, uh... Can I no longer spread my rumor of killing Eliza? Oh, here we go. For some, I thought that they would be green. Uh, here. Um, Great horned owl attacked me. Ibex. Uh, ooh. Mistrum Delwatch. No, um, Raven attacked me, Boogie, Boogeyman attacked me, Armadillo attacked me, there's someone where I killed Eliza. I want to talk about how I slew Eliza. I think it's before here, right? Oh, it's such a pain in the ass. In which I slew Ibex. I want to talk about Eliza, please. Oh my god. Oh, freaking great. I'm about ready to give up. <clears throat> Boy, how.
body, in which I slew Ibex. Unless I just pay attention to what page it's on. Okay. Let's see. One, nope. 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 Mm, nope. Postoons. I should be looking for like different towns. <sighs> false dunes, false dunes, false dunes, false dunes, false dunes. Does it like, is it talking about like the general country or, uh, Raven attacked an alligator? False dunes, false dunes, uh, something hill, the tenacious hill, tiger fish attacked an alligator. Oh my god. I feel like there might be a flaw with this system. I feel like maybe there's something wrong with this right here. I think this might be a problem. I don't think that, that it should work like this. False dunes, false dunes, false dunes, false dunes. Oh! The field of locks. The heavy finger. Raven, Raven, oh god. The hue of brilliance. Wait, is this a... A wild boar attack me? No, oh god. Yeah, I think I'm past where I was looking for. Holy shit. Oh my god. I wanted to talk about Eliza, but I guess I can't. Wasted several minutes looking for it. My honeybee. Hello, goodbye. It was nice to know you now. Alright. Whatever. That's fine. I would think that uh, I slew a honey badger. That's one of my earliest ones. One more quick scan. Which I slew. In which I slew. All these guys attacking me. And camel attacked a honey badger. Vulture attacked me. Camel attacked a fish. Fish attacked a gator. Okay, I'm getting attacked. Vultures attacking honey badgers, honey uh, carps. I'm attacking carps. Oh, oh, most tedious. I'll never find the story again. Once upon a time. Never mind, I simply cannot recall. I suppose I won't be telling you that today. Oh, what was her name again? Uh, a lie, a lie. Oh, I simply cannot recall. Oh, well. Conflict fight. Uh. Let me, let me go back, look at one where I specifically killed something, right? It should be like within the first couple pages. In which, uh, Stingray attacked me, and which, where's the one where I slew a hon honey badger? Where's the one where I killed one of those guys? Where I slew a, that's yeah, conflict fight. God damn it, just never mind. Never mind. Just, I changed my mind. Just... What did I even come here for? Right, I wanted to look at people and see if any of you had any any uh, steel. Um, I might be looking for hearth people. And, uh, yeah, I'm probably looking for hearth people. I don't think these guys are going to have any. I mean, they might like have a steel knife or something. Uh, blacksmith! Urgh. Interest you in a pint? Where's, uh, where's the... This is the town hall, the the town dirt hill. Oh, I got messages. That's fine. God dang, it's been twenty minutes. I th hope I didn't spend that entire time looking for that stupid Eliza. All right, 
Is this a civic mound or a... Hello? Is this the civic mound? Um, oh, that looks like a doctor. It's fish dissectors. Uh, I mean, it might be. Could have sworn the civic mounds were like mead halls, but I might have been wrong. <sighs> no, because this supposedly isn't anywhere near where the civic mound is. Hmm. Where is the civic mound? I simply cannot. Uh, I swear to God, this bet. Ah. <sighs> It's hidden in the hillside, just like dwarves, huh? Hey, you! That's the mayor. I don't really care. I just... Do you have any steel? No, probably not. I'm looking for the hearth people. The hearth! Hearth people! Where be the... The Jarl's men? Where's the house carl? Look at how huge this room is. There's a child. There's some artifact. What's on here? Display case, what's what's in it? Bruh. I don't get why why these ones are like a different color. Whatever. Ah, archery, hey. I used to be an archer myself. Uh he's <laughs> tears. I'm gonna ask him how he's doing there in a second. Alright, I guess he's retired or something, or maybe he's like a ranger in thought. Hello? Yep, don't travel alone at night. How are you feeling? Is this, an, is this an attack? I've been preying on the theme of fortresses. <sighs> He's been praying for the people over in, um... What's it called? What's the place I... I what, uh, He's been praying for the people over in... In, uh... Warm Blanket. It is so undwarfly, and that's coming from a hill dwarf. Alright, so there seems to be no military presence at all here, so I'm moving on. Got some dirty pacifist dwarves. Moving along. How about these ones? Hello, we got some kind of presence up there. I hope I can get... Wow, there's a bunch of priests here. Monks. I wish I could remember the monk theme song. Civic Mound? That's Drinking Mound, though. No. Okay, so that group was the monks, probably. Yeah. Hello! Wow, it's nice and well lit in here. <sighs> Hungry, thirsty, munch a drink. Okay, well, doesn't look like anyone else, anyone in here is a fighter. Siege Operator. You Mace Man? No. These dwarves are defenseless, dude. My search for steel is coming up empty. I mean, I might be able to find some from the uh, undead. Or a fortress. Uh, we got a fortress anywhere nearby? Hello. Hillux. Uh, yeah, we got fortress down there. Hillux. Uh, Hillux. Fortress. I'm going to go to the one to the north. E. I'm going to take a nap first, but... A castle mound? Hello, we might have, um... We might have... Soldiers yet? I mean, there's no guarantee... That is, I swear to God, is this the castle mound? I swear... Frickin' dwarves, man! Hey, you got a book! Uh, I would like that book, please. Can I take it? I'll take that off your hand. I don't actually have anything to trade with, either. Hello. Give me that. Hello. Uh. I would like to request. Please. Give me. Give me that book. Please. No, I don't want to start mugging people. 
list of bandits. Change the subject. Um, trade. You probably see. Uh, okay, so I can't do that. Um, exchange. There we go. Can't trade, but you can exchange. Oh boy. I don't actually have anything to trade with you. Oh, I got some staves. I don't need these. Eh? Where's my boar spear? Oh, there it is. Give me a uh, straight. <sighs> some boar meat? Oh, okay. For a boar meat and a couple of sti sticks, he trade me trade he trade me valuable book. Okay, where's a soldier? I need soldier. Is that an axe man or is a trader? Uh, farmers. Uh, ooh, hello, you lasher or you know blacksmith. I could have been spearman. Slow the heck down, dude. Farmer. Oh my goodness. Boy, it sure would be nice if it wasn't pitch black in here. I hope I can read. I hope I didn't neglect the ability to read. Uh, animal dissector, merchant. God dang it. Why are these dwarves pacifists, apparently? Oh my god. And they're all running around in pitch blackness. Uh, he didn't actually... What, why didn't I take my... That's my staff. Oh man, I traded him my staff. Thank goodness he, he didn't actually take it. <laughs> okay. Man, that would have been a tragedy. Okay, moving on. Oh, wait, I gotta take a little nap. I hope it counts as sleep. Uh, I heard that you can um, encounter a little, little icky bug on the world map if you continuously sleep there okay yeah uh without stopping to like actually rest on the map go around the mountains there we go oh we got a little group in here huh you are uh, some kind of villains or are you monks again i don't know i don't see them anywhere Thought you said there was a group here. Whatever. Keep going. Where's the fortress at? Northeast? Okay. Here we go. Here's the fort. The abandoned fort. Yep, fort entrance. There we go. I'm definitely not going in because I... Oh, good. Thanks. It's a good thing I can fly. Oh, it wasn't that high anyway. I hope I can find which side that this entrance is on before I die an FPS death. Oh. I don't actually have anything to trade though. So what am I doing? I don't know, maybe I can just make a bunch of sharp rocks. Oh, you know what? Let me um, let me read my book. Read that book. <clears throat> I read the Mountain Home Within Reason. It is written. The written the written portion contains a one hundred and forty eight age page guide entitled "The Mountain Home Within Reason," authored by Aerith Problem More. Problem Ors. Concerns a fortress, le leap galleys. Overall, the prose is not awful, but not great either. Okay. I know about leap galleys now. Knowledge. Knowledge. Does becoming a necromancer freeze your stats? That's something I'm going to have to know real quick here. Because uh, next episode, I'm probably going to get that, that spook power. How powerful is your 
magics. I'm going to have to say about six spook power. Oh, look, the the entrance is once again on the last side I, I chose to investigate. Hey, guys, I got bad news in the air. Um, this depot that you got, no one's going to be able to reach it, dude. Uh, the the caravans, they're not going to be able to come here. You're, you're in for trouble. You're going to starve out. And, of course, there are no soldiers here either. God damn it. Um, oh, oh, Lord. Wait, wait, wait. There's one. Um, Hammer Dwarf. Got anything steel? Silver. Um, steel. There we go. We do have steel. Ooh. Ooh. Hello, Hammer Dwarf. Um, hi. I would like to take. I would like to exchange. Probably not close enough. I can't hear a thing you're saying over all this stuff. Let us exchange. Give me your glove. Give me your steel gauntlets, please. In exchange, I will give you this book. It's very valuable. Give me the book. Throw in more goods, please. I give you my paints. I give you my book. I give you my needle. Is this good? Oh, I give you my dagger. I give you my axe. Uh, I part with my special staff and my spear. Both of my spear. Oh, you drive a hard bargain, my friend. I give you everything I own except my skull and my backpack. Everything I own. Ooh, you drive a hard bargain. I give you everything I own, including... Oh, boy. Including my backpack. Oh! oh. My God! You greedy dwarf! I am offering to give you everything I own for your gloves. All right. Everything I own for one gauntlet. Great. Do I have it? Okay, at least I have it. Everything I own. I repeat. Everything I own, including my clothing, for one glove. And that was the day that I learned how to drive a hard bargain. For, you see, what he did not know was that this gauntlet would be what carried me from a local legend to a world-renowned hero. So, to me, I would have paid any price. And I did. I walked out of that room entirely naked. Except in spirit, for I felt as rich as any king. Carrying my one glove. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to pretty much have to start over from scratch here. Um, uh, time. Uh, it's about end of the episode. Alright, so... What we're gonna need, da, da, da. Uh, get a drinky here, I don't have any food, I'm gonna have to hunt things, but I don't have a spear, so it's gonna be a pain in the ass. So what do I need to do to make a uh, bar of steel? I just want a steel bar. Of course, it's probably going to be a pain. Da, 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 da. Or some metal stuff. Um, item dismantling. Oh, here's where you break log into pieces. Okay. Um, 
dismantle a put it on the ground um is that what I'm is that what I'm gonna want though I hope so um anything else where do you do the metal stuff <laughs> I hope I didn't just like waste all of my everything getting okay so I can get that and I would need a rock <sighs> see cuz you can make a forge right that's cooking pot oh boy you can make a forge right I remember you could make am I thinking of the wrong mod here I don't think I'm thinking of the wrong mod here because you can make scrap so I'm sure I'm sure I'm just missing something right oh boy Well, we'll deal with it next time, okay? Hopefully, um, hopefully Chaos Vote will be around. Um, you can give me some advice here. Let me just dismantle my glove for now. I practice my crafting and make nothing of note. I traded everything I uh, <clears throat> I traded everything I owned for that glove and you're telling me that it's not going to give me the fucking steel? I'm naked. I gave you everything I had. Oh. <laughs> <coughs> And then I learned the valuable lesson of humility. Is there anything I can eat here? Eggplant. Can I please eat an eggplant? I lick the eggplant. Ah. Uh, I would like to eat. I would like to eat. How do you eat? I do not know how to eat. I guess I can't eat an eggplant. All right, I guess here we go. I will. I'll. I'll kill something with my bare ass hands. Like a dang shirt rock I'm gonna kill something with my rock sneak hello what do we got up here ravens mm. no I think those are too small I walk through the desert why am I slow what's slowing me down better not be that skull no. Is it sneaking? No, what's slowing me down? Is it the is it the rock? What's slowing me down? <sighs> Hunger. Okay. Idiot. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I I forgot that I I was currently looking for something to eat. <laughs> I just want to get something to munch. After that, I want to see if I can find some some good weapons at the Necromancer Tower. The Zombones, no problem. Tigerfish, hello. Uh, throat, do you have a throat? Tigerfish don't have a throat. But I can bite their head.
just shake it around just shake it around by the head oh I'm hitting them with my skull I don't, I don't want to bash them with my monster skull Come on, I want to eat ya. I mean, I don't even know if this fish is going to be big enough to eat. Come on. Come on. Would you... It's fucking swimming away. Excuse me. Oh, boy. Kick it in the fucking heart. Just get the meat. Oh, we would have a spine. It's too bad that doesn't count as lethal. <laughs> oh, you bruise the bone. There we go, finally. Hit his head enough that... Wait, what was that? There we go. Yes, I did butcher it. There, finally. Something to munch. Cheese. Oh, I should have looked for skin or something. Okay, where's the tower? I just want to... I just want to go... Look. Oh, boy, no. I should probably stop myself, because it's already, like, 1.05... Like in in the video. Hey, look at that cool little uh, ash wasteland. Wow, wow, this looks awful. I hope that there's not like evil clouds here, but also there might be silver barbs, spinnix. Ah, the most evil of plants. Ooh, that spinach. Ooh. Wow. All right. So this place turns things undead. Great. Yeah, okay, so I don't want to get husked or anything, so I'm going to do my darndest to stay away from any kind of odd weather, okay? Make sure I have clouds enabled. Seems like an unsafe place to sleep, too, so let me just... Can I sleep midair? Nope. Nope. <clears throat> Make sure I'm sneaking. I don't want to get boogie manned again. Come on. Come on. You can totally you can totally sleep here. Open space. I just wanna yeah, there we go. I can sleep here. Sleep until dawn. Please don't get boogeyman. Okay, no. What the fuck? Am I on the ground? What the fuck do you mean I'm surrounded by cackling? What do you mean? What the fuck, dude? Oh my god. Oh my god. All right, I had to end the video anyway. It's just, it's just a, it was a warning. <laughs> He's like, get out of here. Sure would have been great if I didn't wake up on the ground. Ah. All right, well, bye. I'll see you next time. I probably won't include the boogeyman fight the next episode because, like, I've already done enough of those. Bye.